Hello everyone, today we're going to be playing Roblox Star Wars Coruscant. Now as you can see in the title it says rework, that means there has been an update. Yeah, so pretty much what we're going to do is we're going to check out the update. But right off the bat here we have a new loading screen, and yeah, it's pretty cool. So, yeah, um, this is one of the updates, new loading screen, um, pretty much the UI is the main update so here we are in the menu which looks amazing by the way i love how we're like in the tram this is the credits these are the basic settings that we have pretty good and this is the shop and this is play with the teams we're gonna check out the mandalorian and republic all right so we're gonna be choosing the republic so now there's two spawns base or border I'm gonna choose base. I mean border, border, sorry. So yeah, here we are, and there's daily rewards, which is really cool, because when you click claim, it'll give you credits. It'll give you all the credits that you need. And so here we are in the game. So another cool thing that happens is um, this, this game also, it now, um, what is it? Ooh, wait. I think the, okay, Executive Waxer, the 212 might have gotten a morph update, but whatever. Anyways, so pretty much what happens is the, mm, is your inventory will now save, which is really cool. I think that's amazing. Um, now, we're going to go over to the power shop because something has changed here. This is completely new. Profile power, this literally shows you everything you need to know, all this stuff. Um, now, I should be Command Sergeant Major, but for some reason it says I'm Sergeant for cl First Class. I do not know why I have the Command Sergeant Major morph still. So yeah, the bot is a little weird, but that doesn't matter. And then, this is the shop here. Nice transition. This is the shop. All the normal stuff that it had usually. And you're probably like, how do we get out of the shop? Well, there's a little red X in the top corner here that you just click in. So yeah, on the side we have our controls and everything. Is then also to sprint is not V anymore. It's left shift, and you have to hold it down. But in recent updates, you, you can now double click shift, and it'll and it'll automatically keep that for you. Um, now ragdolls, as you can see, are a little weird. This person is dead, but um, the ragdolls are strange. Um, as you may notice, the bolts are red. That's because well, um, yeah. Yeah, they haven't changed that. Up in the top right, we have the um, we have the lovely map here, which we can hide, we can uh, show, and when we click on it, it expands, which is amazing. Then in the bottom left, we have a little arrow that we can get out of. Um, top left, we have all our normal things, but now you don't actually have to go back to the power bot. There's a power section, there's settings, and there's a backpack. So yeah, this looks. Mm, this is all really cool, amazing, fun update, honestly. Oh, uh-oh, okay. But yeah, we're gonna do a quick life as guard. It's pretty much the exact same, but the UI makes it look so much cleaner, much better. And if we get shot, um, then there's like a little, the health bar looks different. Everything in this game just looks really different. There's nothing that, there's nothing that different about the map other than the bounty board this is the new bounty board which is pretty cool um oh yeah that's the health new health bar there i'm trying to think of other things that are kind of new um i don't think there's really anything else new oh there's the bounty board yeah but if you if you like hover over people it's like the old like hover information button like the whole old hover information thing but now, but soon they're gonna change it to be um, new, and yeah, so that's kind of cool. Also, I think door transitions have changed, and so you just teleport. Yeah, there's like a little nice little transition for when you go through doors. So yeah, that's pretty much all that has changed. There's nothing really changed. To, uh oh, this cadet's dead. Yeah, but as you can see, the ragdolls are really weird and goofy. But yeah, so we're gonna. We're gonna try. We're gonna try, and uh, so yeah, it's pretty. No, pretty much nothing has changed for Gar. 
from the normal guard, like no duties have changed, nothing like that has changed. So yeah, it's pretty much the exact same for the whole gameplay aspect, I guess. It's just the UI has changed a little bit. Now I'm gonna show you, oh yeah, I'm gonna show you, um, I'm gonna show you uh, what it's like to be a Mandalorian or if, and stuff like that. And it says restricted area passport tier three or above may enter. Now there never used to be passport tiers, I don't think. But now in this new update, I think there was um, because I was playing as a Mandalorian and I got like this weird green passport when usually the passports just look like the old like black passport. But the new, but there's a new one I got which was green and I was really confused. So I think that's what that is. Oh, but yeah, so the, yeah, see, this is really weird ragdoll physics. Um, this person is just open carrying a gun. All right, we're not going to question it, but anyways, yeah, we're going to go right back to the menu and become a Mandalorian. But um, before before I cut the video here, I want to show you something else that's new. This is called the respawn button. So when you click respawn, this um, lovely um, thing happens where you can choose to respawn or go to the main menu. And there we go. We're at the Mandalorian. So now we spawn here. We don't spawn at the raider camp, which I think is a little weird. But yeah, so that's just it's, it's, it's okay. I like it. It's fine. But yeah, but as you can see here, um, this passport on the name, if you can see it, this is Passport 2. So I'm guessing I can enter places that require passport clearance updates. Now they really didn't talk about this in the new update, so I think a lot of people are kind of confused about what this means. Like, I honestly see no real use for this, because like... I don't think the troopers are gonna care. Like, literally no one's gonna care about your passport level. But yeah, anyways, so this is the life of a Mandalorian. <clears throat> Pretty much the normal immigrant thing where you just go through here and you get all that blah 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 and all that stuff and you go through and stuff like that. But unauthorized TK. Okay, um, I'm gonna enter this booth. Oh yeah, and left control is for, uh, um, to see. But yeah, left control and shift lock. Okay, passport. Oh. Uh, um. No. <laughs> hey, let's go. But yeah, so that's pretty much it. Um. Yeah, this is pretty much it for the new update. Like, there's really nothing new other than the UI. Um, now, I'm gonna I'm gonna go over here and see if I can get on the bounty board because I kind of want to show you what that looks like. Like, there's new notifications in the bottom right that happen. But yeah, so bop, bop, got him. Hi. Oh no 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 no. You guys look at me. Okay, I just killed Waxer. I don't know if that automatically puts me on the leader. Uh, yeah, I don't know. It <laughs> You're being hunted. I'm on the leaderboard now. I'm KOS. Yeah, I'm on the leaderboard. There you go, and I die, and you still become KOS. You're still KOS, but if you click get revenge, I don't really know what, oh. Never mind, I'm not KOS anymore. Last time I was still KOS. But also, if you listen very carefully, there is footstep noises. I'm gonna turn down everything else, just like, yep, yep, yep. All this, all the way down, and then I'm gonna turn the footstep noises all the way up. So wait, it might actually not work here. I'm gonna go up here and walk. Yeah, so yeah. There's new footstep noises, I think it's kind of cool. All the, all that this game has to offer now. Like there's new UI, new all that stuff. It looks pretty good. I honestly think it looks good. They're all, expect some bugs though, cause this was pretty a pretty big update. So yeah, just make sure you expect some bugs. 
stuff like that. They're all trying to fix it. it, 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 it it's, it's, all, it's all good, though. It, it's, this is a really good update. I think it helps the uh, game a lot to have another major update at some point. But, yeah. Anyways, I hope everyone did enjoy. If you did, please leave a like. If you enjoy this type of content, please subscribe. And, yeah. Bye.